Nina Sun, 2001 International and Public Affairs. My husband got his admission from you know, Colombia, and uh, I came to Colombia with him and met his, you know, that time the future advisor, the professor Andrew Nathan. And Andrew Nathan asked us, what's your dream, you know, what are you going to do in the future? Will you stay in America or will you return to China? And uh, then we told him, 10 years later, after we return to China, China will recognize Ivy degree and Columbia degree. We want to study at Columbia. So we worked very, very hard to make money by ourselves, not from my parents or his parents. Yeah, it's a big challenge. I worked at Ollis as cashier at the beginning of my husband's you know, PhD study for three months. And my baby, my son was only two and a half months. His dream always come to Columbia. Law Library, that's like his playground. He become our, you know, the connect, our love with both of us, the marriage, and also Columbia. <laughs> He's freshman at Columbia College now. The most important, we got confidence. We get to understand who we are, who I am, more than, you know, before. Not like in China, we all same. There's a lot of the faculties, you know, deans, professors, president came to China and they need the local you know, alumni support to host them, arrange hotel, restaurant, party place, reception place, or you know, meet some you know, government officials or local media. Because I have this kind of connection, I know how to manage this PR event, help the branding of Columbia, promote Columbia in Shanghai, then later on extend to Beijing and other cities. Jinni Sun, International and Public Affairs. You know, they are one of me in the future, and I was one of them there, so just part of them, I feel myself. 